please, please, you gotta save my little girl. Don't come any closer or I'll jump. No, no, please, I'm begging you. Call. Already back? That was a short break, but I'm glad to see you again. Guys, welcome to the channel. We will be getting into Detroit Become Human. Detroit Become Human? Yes. It's a game that has been on a bucket list that I've been wanting to play for a long time. Um, but we're finally knocking it out and getting. we're going to get through the whole campaign. Um, I'm excited for this one. Heard a lot of great things about it. And I heard that the story is very, very immersed. So I'm looking forward to getting stuck into it and seeing what this game has to offer. I'm not gonna waste any more of these guys' time. And let's do it. August 5th, 2038. So he's got some sort of a chip in his head. Negotiator on site. Repeat. Negotiator on site. Blood, that's mad. How'd you need that? How'd you know that? Please, please, you gotta save my little girl. All right, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. You. Why aren't you sending a real person? That is fucking crazy. Wait, how'd you how'd you get this fish? Okay, you got no doubt. Okay, right analog stick. Down on the D pad. Down. Oh, just down on the fucking analog stick. I'm so slow. Save. Let's save it. Right, because it's a it's a robot, right? So it has no no feelings, no emotions, isn't it? Find Captain Allen. This game came out like I can't remember when, but it looks amazing. Find Captain Allen. Okay, I'm sure it's a guy talking. <clears throat> Captain Allen, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Okay. Deviant's name, deviant's behavior, emotional shock, the active. You know oh the shit, we've got a timer. Before this. I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. I don't know we've got a timer. Okay, uh, deviant's name. Emotional shock. Ah! Has emotional he experienced shock. an emotional shock recently? Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Oh, man. Okay, so it does have a consequence then. Understand what happened, save um, hostages at all costs. Locate the hostage. Okay, so how do we locate the hostage or the hostages? Wait, what was that? Okay, I'm a bit confused though, but... Let's search the room for hostages, okay. You can examine the stuff on the floor. 
Am I killing time by doing this? Wow, fresh blue blood. Okay, but I'm assuming the more information we have, the better it will be, right? Okay, okay, okay. Probability of success. So let's let's interrogate a little bit more before we go with it. Go through with it anyway. Because I thought I was on a timer. My oh, shit. Oh, okay, we ain't got a lot of time. Got a nice kitchen though. Oh, I need to go to the body. Can we run? We can't run. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Go and interrogate that body there, and then I think we'll go out. We need the probability of success to go up. Collect some more data. If we get the probability to of success to about seventy percent, I think that's good enough. I feel like if we take too long though in this game, it's just gonna bloody fail or something. Is that all of it? Right, we've got one more clue. Where is it? At? Oh here. Okay. Wow, this game is just m absolutely mad. Okay, so he was sitting down. And he got peppered. Rewind to search for new clue. Okay. Turns around. Bullet to the chest. Oh, okay. Okay, can I, where am I meant to um, stop it at, right? I'm sure there's a point I'm meant to stop it at. Father was holding something. Oh, the iPad. Where did the iPad go? Ah, oh, okay, he threw it over there, damn. This is pretty sick, man. All right. Only 51%. Okay, you've unlocked a dialogue for an action or for action, often beneficial. Okay, nice. I don't like the timer though. We don't have a lot of time, you know. Let's see this guy here. He just got shot. Can we examine him? We can. Guys, this game came out in like 2000 and, where is it? 15 or 14 or something like that? And it's looking better than most PS5 games released now, which is absolutely crazy. All right, got one more clue to get. Okay, so he's a ah, uh, so he's chasing the guy. The guy turns around. 
Does he shoot the guy? Oh, okay. He shot the he shot the guy. Got his blood on the wall, right? Yeah. Wait, I saw a clue there. Oh wow. It's a little girl. Okay, so the bits where it's blue is that where there's is that where there's clues? Maybe? I have to look around for it. I think, maybe, I don't know. Cop shot the deviant, okay. Oh, okay. His hat got fucking blown off though, isn't it? All right, that should be, oh, we got the gun there. Okay, weapon located. Wow, it's proper like a detective, detective game, isn't it? Let's get that gun. Put back, now we taking that shit. All right, what's the prob probability now? I can't even fucking see it. Got his blood on the wall as well. Let's go over here though. I think we're gonna do everything in the room before we head out. Unmute, no, that don't really matter. Okay. Is that a teddy bear on the floor? Or a shoe? Child suit size. I don't want to go outside yet. Oh fuck, he's got the little girl there. Oh. Alright, have we done everything in there? I think so, you know. We're gonna have to go out on the mad thing. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I still don't feel like we've got enough. Come any closer info. or I'll jump! No, no, please, I'm begging you! Go, go, go! My name is Connor! What about you? What is ah, we've got to be quick. We've got to be quick with the responses. Why has it gone down? Okay, the trust. Approach slowly. Calm. I know you're angry, Daniel. What's L1? But you need to trust me and let me help. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is for all this to stop. I just want all this to stop. Are you armed? Lie. Let's lie. No, I don't have a gun. You're lying. I know you have a gun. I'm telling you the truth, Daniel. I came here unarmed. Uh, possible cause. Blaming. Detective. Oh, shit. I tried to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? Damn, this is too quick. I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. All right, goes back up. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with it. Okay, realistic, blaming. Listen, I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No, it's not my fault. I never wanted this. Okay, I'm pretty good at this. 73%? You know? I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. Oh, as soon as we get close, he's gonna catch that bullet. Blame him realistic. Talk to hostage. Are you okay, Emma? Please help me. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. Nobody's going to die. Stay calm. 
Everything's going to be fine. If we shoot him, though, he's gonna fall with her. Tell that helicopter to get out of here. Was that the right thing? There. I did what you wanted. Trust. Rush to the last chance. Last chance. I'm your last chance, Daniel. Ah! If you let it slip, they'll kill you. Let the hostage go. You have no other choice. It went I down. I want to leave. And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. Oh, we're gonna use that gun. Compromise. Compromise. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go, and I promise you won't be hurt. I don't want to die. Reassure. We're not going to die. We're just going to talk. Nothing will happen to you. You have my word. Oh, we got to 100. Okay. I trust you. Fucking hell. Oh wow. What are you shooting for? Damn. So much for trust. You lied to me, Connor. You lied to me. Fucking hell, this is what I have in store. It's about to be a shit show because I know I know I'm gonna fuck up a few times. But it, it's intense, though. It's, it's very intense. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, sniper shot deviant. I wanted to shoot him, but I felt like if we shot him, he would have fell off with the little girl as well, you know? We can continue. This Yo, these graphics are mad. Cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. 200 languages and diets. Anne handles the kids' homework. Elementary school. Good afternoon. Wow. Are we on the shelves? Hey, are we actually in the shop? Oh, these people are for sale. Fucking hell. 1800. Pre owned as well. ZT 200. Half price. That's crazy. It does absolutely all the work around the house. Painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs. At night, it switches to surveillance mode and contacts emergency services if there's a break-in or if it detects smoke. Excuse me, how much is that one over there? The MP800 is slightly more expensive, but it has many of the functions. Thank Come you, along. Amber. Can I go pick it up? Yeah, I don't like this guy. Can you see the future coming towards this? Or, like, there it is. Get into this, this is crazy. It's a bit difficult getting it back in working order, okay? It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. Stupid accident. Oh, I see. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it, meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. That'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. Kara. My name is Kara.
That's mad, man. I mean, getting an Android as a personal assistant or a friend or whatever is only a matter of time before they, um, you know, start to think that they can outsmart you anyway or learn, pick up on your habits and your flaws and think that they can do better. So it's always a lose-lose, man. But so far, man, the intro was absolutely crazy. I am playing on experience instead of casual, so I'm assuming the, the timer for my decisions will be a lot shorter, which is going to lead for a more chaotic but enjoyable playthrough. Going to the slums. That's crazy. So if they're an android, right, they've got a little chip on the side of their head. And if they're human, they, they haven't been chipped yet, I'm assuming. Okay, that's, um, I can't remember his name, but. Go to the Bellini paint shop. All right, let's just um collect some clues on the way, though. What is this? Oh, you can read it. Check out it. Oh, wow. That is so dope. You can change out the magazine like that. Okay, let's see Tech Addicts. Fucking hell, it's literally just like a card and you just can skim through the pages like you're on a touch screen on your phone. That's actually dope. That's actually sick, like. All right, that's enough of that. I hate that you can't run though in this game. You can't sprint. He looks a bit. He looks a bit sad. There's nothing going on with him though. Androids don't get tired, right? I don't think they do. Well, no, they shouldn't, right? Unless if they're programmed. Where are we going to? It's a GPS. All right, right there, straight ahead. Wow. What a scary reality. Okay, my man's grooving though. What does it say on the board? I'm done to hear music within human music. Can we leave a tip? We can't leave a tip. I would have left a tip though. So that's human music. I wonder what Android music sounds like. Okay, let's let's talk to my man here. Let us lie in wait for blood. Let us ambush the innocent without cause. Okay, we've got Brother Dad Charlie up in here. This happen. No, he will not allow his creation to be led astray by these, these artificial demons. Why uh -oh. do you look at me so, demon? I know who you are. I can see through you. You are the one by whom the evil will come. You are the one who will destroy Detroit. Yo, Brother Charlie, we don't want no smoke, man. I'm just trying to get to the paint My shop. Brethren, we have to turn our backs on sin. We have to burn the androids. Let us burn them all. <laughs> 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 
Okay, here we go. Let's put this down a bit. Alright, let's go. Identification verified. Here is your order number 847. That will be 63.99. Please confirm payment. Payment confirmed. Okay. Transaction complete. Little Apple Pay, Mine Pay. That's expensive though, fuck me. Collect package, take bus home. So press R1 to switch camera angle. Okay. So you can do like, he's looking behind. See if anybody's running up on us. Brother Charlie could be trying to run up on us, so we gotta be. Where's he gone? Where's Brother Charlie gone? So we gotta be on our 10 toes, though. Let's see what's going on here. Why do we want? Where the fuck you going, Tin Can? Hmm? What are you doing? Okay. Check it out. Hey guys, check it out. We got one of those tin cans here. Look at this little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't oh, even damn. stand up. Oh, she gonna get it. Okay. She wanna see what I'm made of. They they angry at the wrong people, man. You should be mad at the government. Do it. All right. It's enough. Leave it alone. Let us teach this bastard a lesson. Damage it, I'm gonna have to find you. You have to deep it, yeah. But you are fighting. Good job next. Let's see how you like it. You are fighting a robot, Let's yeah? Literally, like, made by human beings. This thing does not understand why you are hitting it or punching it. So you being mad at the robot is absolutely stupid. You should be angry with the people that are creating this, you know? And that are pushing this agenda. But, um... Yeah, it's mad, it's mad. When you take it into... Into four, anyway, it's actually crazy. Segregation again. They at the back of the bus. The compartment for them is a bit small though, isn't it? Only about maybe six of them can fit on the back there. Mad. I can't believe I haven't. It. it took me this long to play this game, but I'm happy. I'm happy we're here now, man. This guy look like a little freak. What's that over there? Giant Todd. 
He look like he's he's a perv or some shit. You better try and get it on with this robot or something. You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of. God damn it! Where the fuck's the brat gone now? Alice, Alice. Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Damn, Todd, Todd looks like he's abusive, low key. We're gonna find out though if he is, or if it's just my, my gut feeling is telling me that he is though. And he's a drinker. Wash dishes. He done got himself a maid. Yeah. I can see why his wife left him. So he has to resort and get in a robot. Absolutely sad. Depends on what you need. Yeah, yeah, I can get that. You can just order it like that off the off the dome. That's pretty sick. Yeah, yeah. I'll bring it tomorrow. This man can't wash his own plates. We're going to turn the uh, turn the controller. I'm actually scrubbing plates in a game. I mean, I literally just finished doing plates in the kitchen, and now I'm washing plates in an actual <laughs> bloody game. I never thought I'd be doing this. Here we go, we're scrubbing again. Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! Right away. Damn, she's quick. That sink was full. Let's see what he's what he's watching hockey, right? What are you looking at? Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here! I'll get back to work. Damn, can we just get a bottle and smack him on the head when he's not looking? Wait, how we get that? Clean, let's clean the bottle. And then just fucking sm crack him on the back of his head when he's not looking. Take trash, but yeah. All right, let's take the trash out. You got me out here playing a bloody mage, you know. That's absolutely crazy. All right, let's go. Let's do clean up there, innit? That's what we're doing right now. We've got the bottles on the table. Let's go and clean that up. Wow, he's just neglected her, man. Look at her. Just sitting on the corner. It's crazy, man. Credit card application form. 
Overdrafts, yep. He doesn't look like the most responsible man. What are we what are we meant to do here? Like Downtown. Uh, maybe it could be clues for our next thing, right? These buses go to downtown. Is there anything else we can look at? No. So that is an unfinished bridge, and here is a in construction room. They're doing work. Okay, let's go back into the house and see. Decide what else we can do. I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. Can we talk to the little girl? That's a pretty toy. What's its name? Ah, uh, we have to gain our trust. We have to gain our trust. What's he doing? Is he beating his meat? Oh shit, he's doing a little bit of shisha, isn't it? Clean up says. All right, let's go. Sounded like he was doing something. <laughs> Sounded like he was doing something else. What a shithole, mate. I like the design of the magazine, so it's pretty sick. warning antidepressant contains whatever that was did it give us an option to take it or no so we know there's a gun there okay 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 that might come in handy because he looked like he might have to catch a bullet you know he might have to catch one still Let's uh, switch that on, tidy that. He literally just could have paid a maid, you know? Come twice a week, maybe. Clean your house. He went and got a whole bloody Android. A whole AI, artificial intelligence, to come and clean his, clean his house. What did she see? She saw something. Watch it. I'm not even going in there, mate, to clean the bathroom. He's probably left skid stains all over the place. You're gonna go in there later. The nasty motherfucker.
let's have a look at ourselves. Emotionless, like. Damn, this is a, is this a cleaning simulator or? So I'm doing more cleaning in this game than I've done in the last week. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Yo, she's getting abused, man. Alice There's in Wonderland. No way she should be moving like that. Of course. Fucking hell, man. You, you know what? You know what breaks my heart? There's actually kids that are going through this shit, you know, in real life. It's fucking sad, man. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Let's ventilate. Get some root get some air, Alice. Okay, okay, okay. We still going with a bullet. He's gonna catch the bullet for sure. Her imagination is running wild. Seems you like reading. All right, we're gonna go there in a bit. Let's do this. Uh, we need some sort of key. Hmm. Wonder where we can find that. Friendly. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. Name Kara. Mother? No, let's not do the mother. Mother's a bit touchy. Your father said you chose my name. Kara? It's nice. How did you choose it? Leave alone. Let's uh, seem quiet. Let's. You're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. Oh, we got the key. Okay, so we could have fucked that up and we wouldn't have got the key. All right, what's she keeping in there? All right, so we gotta like really pay attention when we're playing this game, because any wrong questions could fuck up a whole, could fuck up a dialogue, you know, fuck up a mission. She got hit on the head. Oh, wow. No. Did a dad kill the mom? 
is he is she buried in the back garden? So my mouth, my mouth is like wide open right now. What the fuck? So I'm if I think we all knew the dad was abusive. That was a that was a given. But beating the... Doing harm to the mum though. And you can tell that's like clear signs of abuse, right? When the child is like silent, doesn't talk. What is he doing over there? What are you doing? Oh, okay. Uh, I'm playing. Playing? I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life, huh? Fucking loser. Yeah. Can't get a job. Take yep. care of his family. Yeah. Don't you think I tried to make things work? No. But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up. I know what you think of me. Wow. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it. You hate me. God. What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. He's got a nice house. Okay, so we've done our errands. Wait, Carl upstairs. Let's let's um have a look around downstairs and see if we can pick up any other potential information, details. He's probably going to eat the bird. Oh, it's a fucking android bird as well. Wow. Okay, let's have a look here. Take sure it's a dining table. We got a lot of information there. Fucking hell, is that OLED? Wow. Super thin. Oh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? What was that a paint enough? You never forget anything. Oh, okay. But to trust an android with all of this is... Give me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. 
But then again, I say that. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. I say that, but then can you trust human beings as well, you know? Oh, this is such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Hey, what happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Enough I do. Yeah, he definitely is not feeling that. I wonder what their their weight restriction is, you know, like their carrying carrying capacity. Anything special so, on the Is anything else we're missing here? I don't think so. Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. There was something through there the we didn't see. Can we leave them? Four messages asking to confirm your attendance. We're gonna have a look through here first. I haven't decided yet. Can we go we'll through see there? See about that later. Okay. What else? No, we can't. Okay. Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Any news from Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. Fucking hell. Okay. I'm trying to get these bloody controls. The camera angles are a bit mad. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Voila. That doesn't look like Television. enough. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carl. Let's go and snoop around. Find something to do. Can we go through there? No, we can't. So close to a no, third it's not. world war. He called on Russia and the United States to promptly renew talks before things get out of control. What is that? Oh. Television off. Mankind is so depressing. Nothing but greed, stupidity, and violence. 5,000 years of civilization just to get to where we are. Yeah, he's got a point. Shakespeare, Keats, Oz, Plato, or Plateau. 
passer. Gaining some knowledge right there. What are you reading? Plato's Republic. It's one of the books you recommended. So, what do you think? I quite like philosophy, I think. It asks the questions that I can't answer. You know, what is right or what is wrong, for example. It's not something that is so easy to decide. Asking questions that have no answers is part of being human, Marcus. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself, make your choices, decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Mm. Some wise words from Carl, but I believe we are taking care of him. But nonetheless... I'm saying, in this life, you must chop, man. You must chop money, because if you don't chop money, you're not going to enjoy, man. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. doing that we're gonna have a look around oh she's painting oh we're just cleaning up then okay a lot of cleaning in this game a lot of cleaning in this game oh what was that Piece, uh... So What's your verdict, Marcus? Nah, uh, no opinion. I'm not gonna lie, I don't like that shit. That shit looks trash. I'm not a very good judge. I, I don't think it's your best work. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. Okay, find a subject to paint. When the, oh, oh, it's an actual face. I didn't even see the face. I just thought, I just saw an ear. <laughs> I didn't think it was his face, but let's paint. Paint this, let's paint this. The statue.
these painting skills must be A1, right? He can just like program, program in the face, keep it in his mind and just, yeah, there we go, bam. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Mm. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Androids, humanity, identity. Ooh, we ain't got a timer in this one. Let's go um, identity. Doubts, despair, prisoner, prisoner. Because we are, we are a prisoner though, low key, isn't it? Oh, he's getting his Picasso. His Picasso on. I'm actually interested to see what the final piece looks like. Oh my God. Hey dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? The worst kind. What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, <laughs> it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No, 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 I swear, it's not that. No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. The answer is no. What? Why? You know why. Because you're a bloody yeah, crackhead, yeah, that's why. why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's it got that I don't? It's smarter? More obedient? Not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. Hmm. You never loved me. What a piece of shit for a son. I bet he wishes he was a bloody android as well, wouldn't it? He never had that. I don't know how we can get the other dialogues though. I don't know how I keep missing out on the other ones. Scan faces. Scan his face. Jimmy. Jimmy Peterson is not him. 
Let's see, my man here. What's your name, sir? Derek Myers. 89? He was born in 89? Oh, it is um, 2038, right? Okay, because I'm born in 89, so I'm like, wait, I know I don't look that old, but I probably will, <laughs> I probably will do in, in 2038. God willing, God willing we get there. Okay, that's not who we need. Nineteen ninety five, fucking all mate. Wanna buy me a drink? Who's he? Okay. You search this guy. You can't search this guy's face though. So he's not looking at us. Oh okay, we got it. We got it. There we go. That's who we need, right? Do self. Can we scan these people anyway? Let's just scan all of them. Because you never know what we, what we could get out of it. Criminal record. What's the criminal record? Narcotic supplier. Stereotypical. Can't stereotype a black man like that. It's crazy. Let me guess. Is he selling drugs as well? Oh, he's got no. Okay. No criminal record. That's what we like to see, my brother. Okay, clean record as well. That's what we like to see, my bro. Um, okay, there's nothing we can do in there. Android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife Android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Reason, understanding, persists. Let's persist. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I must insist. My instructions stipulate that I have to accompany you. You know where you can stick your instructions? <laughs> no. Where? <laughs> he really has no idea. Never mind. Ah, oh, fuck, that went down. Okay. Threaten, reason. I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. Nope, that was the wrong choice again. Buy him another drink. Way outside, spill his drink. Oh shit. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. See that gym one is a technology. Make it a double. The man likes his whiskey. The man likes his whiskey. Let's say that. Oh. <sighs> Did you say homicide? Okay, so we got him. We got him out, out of the bar. No, is that the same house? That's not the same house. Here. Be wrong. 
My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up and you wait here. So it's a promises, okay. Can we follow him? Are we connected? Charles <laughs> Douglas from Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Have they said anything? I don't even know. Typical DPD. They don't tell us shit. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. Nigga, you are Android. What part of stay in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Even at Hank, we were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around 8 from the landlord. The tenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. That's when he found the body. Well, it was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record. Any clues around her? Uh, quite a few, okay. For theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time, they hardly ever saw him. Oh, we're doing our own little research. Believe that. Oh, stay easy, and not worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good time. Fuck yeah, no, he got slumped. Isn't the it? Gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Jesus Probably Christ. Murder weapon. Any sign of a break in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. No fingerprints. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. Said so 19 days, so it happened 19 days ago. Well, if you think about it, it's perfect for serial killers, right? They can just kill people and blame it on the androids and say it's the androids that are doing this. Was his body dragged, Shredder maybe? Perfect. It's way too neat. No human right. Fingerprints. It's like this. reconstruct and see what happened so the guy stabbed him after as well oh okay so they took a knife cut his ass So he was the the victim, well not the victim, the guy that got killed, he was the aggressor. 
Okay. We need to find that knife. Uh, the knife is in the front room, right? We've got the knife. Okay. Diva took the knife. Slash his throat. We've got the baseball bat. What else did he drop there? Nothing else, right? The table. Okay. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. <laughs> Android sex officially better. I knew I knew it was coming there. Consider it done, Lieutenant. No, we still got some more we need to do. We've got two more. Yeah, that's it. What is through here? Let's go through here. Any clues in the back? Okay, we've got footprints. Locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. No, this type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. So we need to get two more. I think the last two should be through here, right? Obsessive writing. Some sort of cult, maybe? Looks like cult blue. Okay, and I think the last one was on the actual victim, where it says, I'm alive. If we go closer to the body, we should be able to examine it. Time of death, love, yeah. It's a big boy. Have a look. He stumbled over. Fits and fell here. Oh, man stabbed him again. Okay. Came from the kitchen, stabbed him one more time. Forward over the bell, uh, the bear bottles. You got stabbed again? Oh shit. Oh, he just left him there. Oh damn. One last fatal, fucking hell, how many stabs was that? Fucking hell, yeah. He, 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 meant to, he meant to finish the job and he did it. He was stabbed 28 times. Yeah. 
Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Yep. Let me see this. I didn't see that. Hey, my life. That's clearly signs of like a, a serial killer, right? Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started in the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android. Uh, the victim with a bat, with a bat, right? Yeah. With the bat. Yeah. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Uh, the android stabbed the victim, the victim stabbed the android. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... The front room, the living room. The living room. Yeah, that android was on smoke. I tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. With the bat, with the knife, without a weapon. With the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. Ah. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat <coughs> and lost some theory. Lost well, some what? Ethereum. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Let's search for this blue blood. Oh, we see it right here on the floor. It's not there, but it'll probably be in the attic, right? How can we get up to the attic? Find something to climb. All right, so we have to try and get a ladder, maybe. I'll make our way up there. Find something to climb. You can't go out that way. Is there some sort of a ladder? Wait, you know what? I'm gonna go back there, because I feel like if I leave the house, it could just end the mission or some shit, so... Let's see if we can move. We can move something. OK, 
Okay, those those dialogues wasn't there before. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Uh, I'm going to check something. I thought we had to actually go and find a ladder. I wonder who that is. We've got our perpetrator. I feel like we've got to help that android out though, you know. He was getting abused, isn't it? And God knows how long he's been getting, getting abused for before it just backlashed. Why the fuck did he say it? Oh shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now. Come on! He didn't even give me an option, like he didn't even give me an option to to, to defend him. That's crazy. Cause if I had if I had the choice, me personally, I would have had his back and yeah, he would have known a damn thing. Guys, that's going to be it for this one. I'm going to catch you on part two. I'm going to see you on the next one. Peace out. And one love.